Hi friends, welcome back to the part 20 of this tutorial series. So in this part we will see how we can protect our admin section to only uh, be accessible for the logged in users. Right now anybody can come in here and click on the admin button and go to the admin dashboard. We want to prevent that. Okay. So this we will do with the help of auth cards. To create an auth card in node.js it's pretty simple so since we are using passport so as soon as the user is authenticated it injects uh, a function that is is authenticated to the request object okay so in our custom function we'll create a new custom function to check whether the user is authenticated or not is user authenticated so we'll create a function that will have three parameters as usual request response and next so you want to check if request dot is authenticated so this function is uh, given to us by passport package okay so we'll check if this is true or not if this is true what do you want to do we want to call the next and go to the next uh, set of instructions okay otherwise if this is false we want to redirect the user to our login page okay so we have defined this function but we haven't we haven't used it yet and this is indicated by this gray uh, gray color of this uh, function okay if we want to use it for the admin routes okay so if I go to my routes and I want to plug it in here for all the admin routes okay not just for one route so I'll put it here and before I can use it I have to import it using the require statement config custom functions and from that file I'll only use is user authenticated okay and I'll simply put it here like that okay that's it I don't have to do anything else so this will check if it, if it passes it will go to the next uh, instruction which is this one otherwise it will take you to the login page let's test it out test this out okay so right now I'm on the home page and if I click on admin I'm not authenticated as of now so if I click on admin it takes me to the login page no matter how many times you click it okay and then as soon as you get authenticated it takes you to the admin page and if you go back and refresh the page you can still browse the admin section okay so this is stored in a cookie okay in, in a session basically and if you open a new tab go back to the same URL you can still use it okay so this is all about uh, auth card and what I want to do next is to hide all these menu items based on the authentication state okay so I have created a new variable here this user variable so which will be either equal to null or this user object that is again injected by passport so I want to do, do some fancy stuff here if I go to my partials uh, default top navigation okay I want to hide these uh, menu by menu items based on the uh, authentication state okay so I will leave the about as it is I don't want okay so here I'll put an if check so if the user is present what I want to do I want to show the admin section that means the user is authenticated else okay so I will put an else statement here so this is how you do if else in 
handlebars okay so else I'll show this okay and you, and you don't need to close the else statement it's only the if that you need to close so once you save it go back to the browser refresh you see the since I'm authenticated right now my register and login buttons have gone so if I close the browser and reopen it okay and go back to the URL I'm still authenticated let me just quickly go ahead and delete the cookie uh, here okay uh, delete this everything okay now refresh the page I should see the about login sorry the login and register button and I cannot go to the admin section if I type the URL manually it will still throw me back to the login page and as soon as I log in I'm taken to the admin section and if you go back the login and register buttons are gone now okay alright so this is all about the auth card and how to protect your admin routes in the next se uh, section we will start working on the uh, comments which we don't see it yet so we will see how we can uh, save new comments and approve or disapprove them and this button doesn't take you anywhere as of now okay we'll fix it so till then stay tuned and have a wonderful day bye bye